it's Kilobyte here, and in this video we're going to talk about hammer arresters. So when you turn your washing machine on and it starts filling up with water, do you hear kind of a banging noise? Like maybe your pipe's banging? Or perhaps you've got a sprinkler system that is on a timer, and every time it kicks on, you get that little knocking noise? Well, that's probably your pipes, and what happens is, on these washing machines, some of them are worse than others, uh, or your sprinklers, when they turn on to allow the water to come in, it's like instant, all on, which causes a pressure change in your pipes, which then causes that knock. And it's literally the pipe banging. You want to make sure your pipes are properly secured under your house or wherever they are run, but you can still have it happen. I'm going to show you how to install these. It is very simple and it'll stop that knocking for three to five years. So if you can pull your washing machine out a little bit for some better access. As you can see, I've already got some on mine. Oh, and there, I will put a link to the ones that I'm using in the description and you may need adjustable pliers so turn your turn your water off so i have unplugged mine and i have just to be on the safe side put a towel around the pipes here so that if they drip hopefully they'll drip on the towel and Yeah, I'm going to need to use a wrench. Like I said, I've already got them. If you don't have, have yours on yet, you just got to remove the hoses from the inlet. And try not to break <laughs> your wife's crafts or your crafts or whoever's. Just a little bit of water. Not bad. <laughs> Did you see that? Did you see that where it starts coming out after I had stopped there, moved the towel? Okay. Yeah, some came out. So here, I don't know who put this on, but they got it good and tight. All right, I know who put it on. <laughs> it is full of water. Piece of advice, just a little tip. I have the new one out of the bag. <laughs> I can't put the hose down because the it's full of water. It and this is like a hose fitting for your outside hose. It's the same thing. You want this to be facing the back right here as much as possible when it's tight. It does have a washer, so you don't have to, don't over, you don't need to crank down on it. Make sure, check and make sure there is a washer in here. Same process for the cold water. Ugh. 
Oops. <laughs> oh man. I might be in trouble. Oh boy. <laughs> I may have got lucky. Hopefully nothing important broke. Eek. Eh, no one will notice. And yeah, don't tell her. All right, no leaks. We'll check it again once we start the washing machine. Just to be sure, you see that? Let's see if we have any knocking. <laughs> Hopefully it's picking up that it's filling. There, kicked in. For leaks. good the little trick I use is to put a paper towel under the key places where it would be leaking and if the paper towel gets damp you know you got a leak and you need to tighten it up a little more so hope that was helpful if so please like subscribe comment and good luck with yours